first started, you know, when I got here about six years ago, and I remember having a conversation with our then superintendent, Dr. Graves, and he had this little block of sand out the front of his office. And he used to come out there, and it was just a calming thing, and he would, he would rake that sand. And I remember going and talking to him about six years ago and, and telling him, you know, if he really wanted to leave his mark here, it wasn't going to be about the technology. It was going to be about the team. It was going to be about the teachers. It was going to be about impacting teaching and learning in the classroom. That was the mark that we wanted to leave, was to get you know, all of that infrastructure and all of that stuff together and, and make it work so that we could get to a day like this where we could start connecting with teachers to start sharing you know, and to start telling our story. So that's our question to you is, is this year, you know, will you leave your footprint in the sand? Our technology department goal, and it's probably not a goal that you see by many technology departments, but this is ours. Our goal when we talk to our team, to all of our technical support staff, to our educators, everything is about connecting educators, everything is about empowering teaching and learning. That's what we want to do. We want to try to break down the barriers and make it simpler for you to make an impact you know, in the classroom on a daily basis. So that's our goal as a tech department. Every decision we make is based around that. I had the opportunity this summer to go to ISTE, uh, the ISTE conference, and, and, and it's just a, that conference, it's, it's, the, it's the best educational technology conference, it's, it's worldwide, there were over 20 some thousand people that came to participate, people from all over the world, it was just amazing. But the keynote speaker who closed it, and if you get a chance, go back on YouTube and check out this keynote speaker, Adam Bellow, the closing keynote at ISTE 2013, absolutely amazing, okay? inspirational but at the beginning he challenged us he said an invitation to change the world and as I reflected and I thought about that I thought about the amazing teachers that we already have in Jackson and Hillsdale County I thought about the amazing things that you do on a daily basis and I think you're already changing the world I think you're already making that impact a day like today though is to help us take that amazing teaching those amazing experiences and bring it to the kids using the tools of today, using these kids' tools, using the tools that they're used to using. And that's the next challenge. So we have amazing teachers, amazing lessons, amazing plans. The question is, how can we start using today's tools so it's relevant to them? Okay. So here's my challenge to you. I don't want you to be limited by what you don't have. I know times are tough. I know not everybody has the same equipment. You don't have the same devices. Some of you have just a single desktop in your room. But what I challenge you is to try to do great things with what you do have. So if I were back in the classroom today, which I, I, I miss, you know, all of us on our team, we just miss being in the classroom. But if I was in there and all I had was a single desktop, I would try to find ways to do great things with kids with what I had. And so that's my challenge to you this year is to, hey, you know, this is what we got. When I talk with my team, that's what we challenge them every day. 75% of their jobs try to work with you to utilize the tools or what you do have in your classroom versus, you know, that shiny ring, that shiny apple, that shiny whatever, you know, iPad. Who, who cares? You can do amazing things with a lot of stuff. Okay. So this year, to make it easier, we're going to bring you new tools.